Hey everybody, welcome back to more Let's Play Dark Cloud. In between episodes, which I guess I'm going to show you is by show you my save. I ran shipwreck ten times. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> you didn't even tell you didn't even tell me that before we started. No, I didn't. So uh, <laughs> I so I, I found out that the hammer I was looking for it only appears in shipwreck, so I ran it ten times. And you found it. So while I was at it, I also made. Four big bucks hammers. Uh, <laughs> I also <laughs> but look, I'll check this out. Yeah. I, I did find a bunch of I did find a bunch of hammers. But uh I found another last judgment. Okay. Do I know it's better than two last judgments though? Three last judgments. Three last judgments. <laughs> <laughs> yes. They're all in the shipwreck. Yeah, they're all in the shipwreck. <laughs> so I'll yeah. let you just completely hit this for me. <laughs> so I've been working around on stuff. I found also on a small sword. I have a kitchen knife here I was working on. I also found a Chris knife. Uh, and that's the that's one more kitchen knife. I basically like got everyone to points where they can actually like do stuff. Uh, I ran the back floor enough times to end up getting two diamonds, so I don't worry about that. Oh my god. So now we just go and give this to uh, Chewy now. <laughs> However, it would help if I didn't do that. <laughs> did you just throw? Yeah, I did. Anyway. <laughs> luckily nothing happened I... yet. <laughs> I really hope you saved. Oh, yeah, I didn't do anything. It's fine. <laughs> I'm not used to having status break there for so long. I was I was worried that eventually I was, I was going to do that. And there you go. <laughs> Did it right there at the start. <laughs> I, uh, I left Def on red for like a few hours before we were supposed to start recording. So clearly... Went nuts. <laughs> well, I mean, I, I I didn't do that in the meantime. I was doing that over the weekend. <laughs> so in reality, you actually just left me on red for like four days. And I was like, all right, fine, I'll do something. I'll find that's find true. Find that's that's why. I, if you're wondering why our video is delayed this week, because I left him on red for four days. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, like I was saying, so we can upgrade Chewie's slingshot. Upgrades usually second. Status break. Yeah. Sa uh, status break. Uh, upgrades usually second to last, so I mine really went there. So we can upgrade this by sticking. Actually, I'm just sure. Yeah, just stick the diamonds in there. It's insane how many diamonds that thing needed. <laughs> no, you needed because it, it needed 20 metal breaker, which is super hard to get. That's really the only problem. Uh, oh, look, build up is glowing. So now we can get the hard shooter or double impact. Demi chose this one. We're doing hard shooter. Yep, because you wanted the hard route. <laughs> He <laughs> asked me if I wanted the hard route, and I said yes. Yes. You said, <laughs> you said, do you want to do it the fast way or the slow way? You said the slow way, so I was like, all right, sure, slow way. <laughs> so now that we have this, we can also, oops, uh, I believe the one that, so like, I, for all these hammers, I also give them certain attributes. So like this one, hey. it's a lot of mint breaker. This one has thirst and big bucks, but it has like a ton of fish on it. <laughs> Because of the yeah. this one has a lot of holy on it. That one's for later. So I think the one that Chewy needs, um, because her because her thing has like such like fast boosts. I think I want to give her this one. Yeah, this one has like nothing on it. So yeah. let me go ahead and status break this hammer. Yes, we are gonna be doing this like now just to get out of the way. <laughs> I'll clear out the inventory. <laughs> I was like, dude, this, this, the amount of upgrades we're getting right now it just takes like nine episodes. So, yeah, I have all that applied there. Let's see. Yep. Okay, cool. So, uh, the next one you're going to get is probably double impact. Uh, I'm going to have you decide which one we get after that, or well, which one we're going to get next, because this one kind of splits. Okay. Uh, I need to go and look at the stats, though, so we'll deal with that in a second. Uh, next up, we have uh, Krill here. I found out that we still have the uh, we still have the Sin Sphere for the battle axe that we're not using too much. Yeah. Uh, I believe Krill is super close to having his hammer ready. So if we up actually, I guess we just look. Yeah. Okay. So if we upgrade this, <laughs> Def has some method to how he decided we were gonna do upgrades. <laughs> for this, uh, for Krill, I had Demi choose this one. Yeah, you said like I chose one, you chose one, but I have no, I have no recollection of ever choosing anything. 
but I also don't remember anything ever. So I told you. I oh yeah, I remember, I remember I this one. I asked you, do you want elements or attributes for uh, for Krill's for Krill's uh, hammer? You said attributes, so we're getting the battle axe again. <laughs> We're getting another battle, battle axe. Yeah, but this one's way stronger. <laughs> and with that, we can also... So you, you sent a battle axe into it to get another battle axe? Yeah, it's because it has all the stuff on it. But it has way That's more really stats. So the next thing we're going to need is... We're going to stats break this week, Buck's Hammer. Okay. We're going to turn a fire on it. For the platinum ring. And no, we're going to give it to this battle axe. Because this is the, <laughs> the next, this, next thing the battle axe needs, or at least down the road at some point... It's going to need fire and a lot of it. <laughs> so I made a big box hammer with a lot of fire on it. It's really quite impressive that you were able to do this much min maxing. <laughs> That's really the only way we're going to actually level up weapons, though. So I'm glad you finally did it. And I we were just straight up winging it before. And I chose uh, Orem's. Uh, what, what final ring we're going for for Orem? And it is going to, and I find out that the big bucks hammer that we used for one of these other ones. Well, not is it on the hard shooter? Uh, no, I took it off the hard shooter because I thought I did. The hard shooter has those two. Well, it has a plus five one for the plus six one. Oh, right, the fairy ring has it. I forgot. <laughs> there it is. So we can put this hammer on the platinum ring, and it doesn't lose a lot of stats from doing it. So we can. So this is like the big. This is like the big bucks hammer we had for a while. Oh, our favorite big bucks hammer. Yeah. This one needs a lot of elements. I think it needs a lot of holy. But I already made this one, so I figured it should probably go to somebody. <laughs> and I think that's about it. Oh, right. So also, the, all, the, all of our main weapons have. Oh, they don't all have bucks yet, so the yeah. chopper's gonna need bucks. So the chopper here, uh, the the weapon that run, that ah, sorry, the weapon that won was the golden sword in our poll. Dang. So yeah, my, <laughs> my, my my attempt to overthrow the people's vote didn't work. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and get the chura. <laughs> oh right, we have okay. So it's a good thing they chose they make you not do that. <laughs> I totally forgot. What happened? Oh, it, it wouldn't let me. It wouldn't let me build up with the upgrades on it. So, yeah, we're going to go and get the Chura. Okay. I think it just like, looks cooler, but it is a golden sword. <laughs> <laughs> was, it, was the other one pirate? Yeah, the other one was a pirate sword. Pirate Cutlass. <laughs> um, I think I... Sh yeah, okay, so I do have two more big bucks hammers here. I forgot. <laughs> yeah, this is the holy one, and this is the one with Quench also on it. So, I think... Ooh, I'm gonna have to make another one, probably. Because I already fused. Uh, so so I all it. five of them have bucks, right? Yeah, the the one there though has quench and I, I guess I could just do it anyway. It doesn't matter too much. <laughs> it's just quench. But uh, yeah, this one has a lot of sea killer and quench on it. I Wait, suppose our, I can... our gold our gold sword needs to have bucks, doesn't it? Yeah. So I was going to status break this one and just give it to the Chura anyway, even though it has this quench on it. I mean, it's not that big a deal. Yeah, that's, that's it's just fine. A, it's just a quench. It's just a kitchen knife. <laughs> not much of a problem. So I mean, it would gonna... only make sense to give it to. Does Chewie have already have to quench? Yes. Well, actually, so no. it... what I was going to do is. I was going to. What does the hard shooter has? A, the hard shooter has a status. It has two statuses. It has steel. Oh. Yeah. yeah, that's what I meant. The one I, I didn't recognize. Yeah, I mean, we haven't gotten any steel weapons. We only got one. So I, so, I can. Oh, I can but I can... It, already, it already has bucks. Yes, I just put. Okay, bucks so yeah, so yeah, it, bucks is harder to get than actually. I guess they're both equally as easy to get. So. Yeah, yeah, just go, 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 yeah, we go, 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 go. Yeah, so I can just use the kitchen knife in order to make a uh, thirst weapon or to fuse thirst on later. And I was in mono talking because I was buying stuff, but we can go ahead and head back to the Sun and Moon Temple finally. Hey, everyone's going in fully loaded with. Actually, the, why didn't we upgrade the platinum ring yet? Platinum ring wasn't full on uh, ABS, was it? 
Oh, it can't. We're not. We we don't have enough to upgrade it right now. Yeah, it wasn't. Oh, okay. <laughs> and then the battle axe. She said, "So need something else." Yeah, the battle axe needs more fire. It was at forty-seven fire. It needs more fire. Yes. Although I guess I, I guess I can check to be sure I'm right about that. I, I know it needs a lot of fire at some point. Yeah, he's on fire. Ah. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and save the game, and we'll meet you inside. I try to keep some surprises to you because, like, I I obviously mentioned, like, I found out that I, you get the you get one of the hammers in shipwreck, and I didn't find it, but I found two last judgments, and I just didn't tell you. <laughs> <laughs> I also had five fully loaded big bucks hammers. <laughs> you got all those on the oh, on the back layers? Uh, well, I, I made them the back layers. I had to buy them all. I actually didn't show you our money. We actually have 2,000 gilda. <laughs> I assume we probably were fully loaded. Oh, you remember the voices, right? Mon, Simun, what's happened to you? Backwards. I heard that C I heard that Simun is the strongest warrior in the whole Muska Desert. Maybe he used to be, but not anymore. He failed to protect village. He is no longer a warrior. He's weak now. Mm hmm. You know what? Being strong in on the battlefield and being truly strong as a person are not the same, are they now? What do you think of Beast, the one who was with me? What do I think? I don't understand. I sense something very strong from that person. Like a will, a power deep within him, in his heart. I don't know exactly what it is. But it's special. Yes, Beast is strong. I am weak. Oh boy. You wonder what I find funny, though, is, like, in this game in particular, your characters don't get stronger than weapons do. <laughs> <laughs> but he clearly has a very weak spear right now. Probably a tier one. Probably when he, when it breaks, it stays with him like and a terrible Beast weapon. <laughs> Beast definitely has the highest tiered weapon right now. Okay. Well, here's a golem. All right, you know what we have done in a while? We haven't had a word with Steve in a while. Chewie is oh dying of thirst. <laughs> I do not replace. <laughs> Jeez. There is water in here. Oh, there is. You're right. I actually don't think it's good. he's going to say anything because this message box won't go away. <laughs> there we go. Anything to say, Steve? Nah. Nah, he's not interested, I guess. <laughs> this is why I just want to talk about these guys. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh, he just fried that thing. <laughs> And solar repair powder. I did. Hundred and thirty-nine. Uh, we appear to be quite strong right now. We are. Obviously, the golem is stone. Is a stone enemy, so stone breaker makes it stronger. Which we have barely invested into at all. <laughs> we don't need it. <laughs> you sure we don't need it? Yeah. <laughs> you don't think 200 damage is enough? <laughs> I mean, we're definitely max right now. We used to be min. I just realized I never actually put another thing onto this. <laughs> also, it's also the gems I have. <laughs> I have four aquamarines. <laughs> this, like, this is Mimic Breaker. Or, sort of notice, but... So what stat does she need to get to the next level? She needs... Uh, actually, I think she can already do it. Let me see. No, okay. So I think the one we need is this one. 
It's ho holy and... It's holy, mostly. Unless I'm thinking of the fairy ring shit. Yeah, actually, yeah. It, so that one's the fairy ring. I can tell you right now, because that's the next thing, ne that's the thing that's next. So it's actually this one. So she needs wind and holy. Unless that is the fairy ring, because I didn't realize they both had holy. <laughs> either way, we, either, either way, we need a lot more holy. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> here we go. Also found out something interesting about the bone rapier that I completely forgot about. It's pronounced rapier. Rapier. It's rapier. <laughs> it's French, brother. Uh, two levels later, you get a weapon that has a unique attribute on it. It's the only way to get it, too. Which one? Uh, two, two, two weapons after... Yeah, I missed that one. Uh, two weapons after Bone Bone Rapier. <laughs> <laughs> you get a you get a new uh, ability that I have not seen yet. So I was wondering if you want to invest in the Bone Rapier that I have and get that poison? ability. It's not poison. Uh, I mean. If you felt like grinding up two le two tears from the bone rapier, <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't be against it. I suppose. <laughs> I actually do have fun playing this game, but I'm not getting destroyed by to reduce every ten seconds. <laughs> <laughs> you had to go fight a lot of them in this shipwreck. Not on the floor I was doing. <laughs> <laughs> by the way, I I grinded on floor sixteen, I believe. The back floor in that one has a lot of mimics on it. And a king mimic, which gives you a ton of experience. I almost like we should level up our main weapons on the front levels and the side weapons on the back level, or is that op opposite logic? Well, either way, <laughs> these are the strongest weapons we have. So I'm going to be using them and swapping, usually. <laughs> I feel like we don't end up using our normal weapons a lot, which is why I try to put the codes I'm using to them before I evolve them. Yeah. I didn't mean to do that anyway. Oh! Ow. Oh my god. Thanks, camera. You're going to put it on the camera? Well, it flipped around, so I couldn't back up. <laughs> I mean, you also pa panic swapped. There's a lot going on. I didn't panic swap. I meant to swap. What? I know. I know you didn't panic swap in like the technical sense, but you messed up and then swapped at a very inopportune moment. <laughs> well, I meant to damage the mimic first because you saw what happened last time. I didn't do that. Weapon. What happened last time? You didn't do that. Sandbreaker. I oh. broke a weapon. <laughs> <laughs> To be fair, that was like three weeks ago when you recorded that video. It was last week. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it was like two weeks ago, technically, I suppose, at this point. The Sandbreaker is new. Sandbreaker. Okay, yeah, I guess the Sandbreaker is new. Uh, actually, is it new? No, it's not. Because I remember the ability that's on it. It's Thirst, which you don't want. <laughs> Dang, is you parched? It does. You already know how quickly you get parts in this game. That's true. There's a lot of stuff going on in this room. <laughs> I can hear it. I heard a phantom. I heard a golem and the phantom. <laughs> Multiple golems. Did him walk up very slowly. I'll get stunned. Uh, uh. I could have thrown that anyway, but... <laughs> Alright, so let me check something really quick. Alright, the, the one we want is just the holy one. So it's this Top one. one? Yeah. I figured we could fuse yeah, it with something for you, like, something like... Tiny it's either or Aquamarine or Topaz, since we have a zillion of those things. Alright. Topaz gives us extra stats, so I'm going to get I don't know where we're going to get holy from, though. What gives holy again... Actually, diamonds. Oh, diamonds doesn't give holy. Rubies. Rubies gives fire. 
Sapphires. Sapphire gives ice. Aquarine and Sapphire both give ice. Yes, there's like five ice gems. I don't know why. <laughs> See, Turquoise also gives ice. I didn't even know Turquoise was a thing. Well, I just fused it. I actually didn't just fuse it. In. I was using it, what, a while. This <laughs> this Phantom really wants this fight. And I just keep refusing it. Dang, I think I got way stronger after we just upgraded it. I put like... two shot it instead of a three shot. I put two Torquors on it, which gives... Which is 20... Uh, which is 20 Stonebreaker. Oh. All right. So this should be the last kitchen knife we need. Uh, we're gonna need two more. Oh, one for Sea Moon. Yeah. Oh, so you just you just spoiled that we get Sea Moon in the party. I thought we already established that named characters get added to the party. Anyway, so this kitchen knife also has times two. I'm not sure if you actually <laughs> want to use it for anything or not. So I was just letting it sit here. Uh, you definitely put that bandit slingshot on it. You can't. I mean, I can't put it in there putting, for extra stats. Putting, putting a diamond on it until the end matters. So just stats break it then. Uh, oh, instead of abzing? Yeah. I mean, it's kind of a waste of a times two, but. <laughs> yeah, well, a times two and a kitchen knife, sure. I know, it also like, doesn't matter because it's a kitchen knife. If you status break it, then you could put it on the... We need to put it on a the chur, right? Uh, yeah, I guess we could. Actually, no, we don't need it... to because it already has a hammer on it. But the chur doesn't have... Or is it the ban oh, the slingshot doesn't have... The slingshot doesn't have thirst on it? No, it doesn't. Or quench, rather. So you already have a kitchen knife that you could put on the... Uh, slingshot. Yep. So that way we wouldn't have to side level one? Nope. Uh, I mean, I'm definitely down with not side leveling one. <laughs> you know how much I hate side leveling. <laughs> too bad we're constantly doing it, huh? It's fair, that, is, that is definitely too bad. Doesn't need the levels anyway. <laughs> Here we are, OP right now. We should use a uh, Chewy so we get the steals. That's true. We also don't need more repair powder because that's what they drop. Because we have freaking eleven of it because I keep stealing it. <laughs> <laughs> but we're gonna have to use one right now. That's true. Oops, that's the wrong weapon. You could kill it with that. No, I can't. I'm also not breaking it on this thing either. <laughs> Fast chomp. Yeah, I didn't realize that monsters have different le speeds of attack until this playthrough, basically. Maybe I did know and just forgot. So the mimic can attack faster than a phantom. I think we do know that. Well, it has so like there's that attack, and then it has like a faster version of its chomp, which it was doing earlier, which is why it escaped from my attack earlier too. Is that why? It's true. That's because you just mistimed it. <laughs> exactly. I mean, you're not sure. Oh, I'm definitely sure. I've seen them go at different speeds. <laughs> I don't know what we can get out of here now. So no keys to the back floor. We have never seen a back level. No, we haven't. We have a little extra time. With our with the two atlas we got in this floor for some reason. <laughs> Actually, do they you're say gonna, different? You're gonna finish Simon's house. The moon, weak, beast, straw. Sea moon is in bad shape. I'll have a talk with him. You're about to sleep. It's like a Jar Jar Binks 
accent there, weren't you? Uh, I have no idea anymore, dude. <laughs> I'll have a talk with him. <laughs> Me so have a talk. That's more Jar Jar Binks. It is. And Seaman's house can't... We can't change anything about Seaman's house because it's already down. So of all these, though. Sure. Oh, wait, we got something in here? Oh, it's Shibubu. I forgot about that. We still can get to his house because we don't have any stairs. We can't build his house if we have stairs. We can't get to his house. We I can't guess. get into his house without stairs, yeah. Oh, he wants a cabin. Oh, uh, we can put this in here too. You're going to notice that every house here is going to have a totem pole to stick here. And they're very it's like important. A sign. <laughs> a sign? Yeah, yeah, I guess it is. It's like every every house needed a torch. Put on Brooks house. Just like over here. There is a treasure box over here. Fish candy. Now you might be noticing throughout everything that we've done so far. Chewie is probably the weakest link in this team. I will assure you this will not change. What? <laughs> At the start of the game, she's really good, obviously, because she's like your only ranged character. Once you get another ranged character that does way more damage, she like her use kind of like kind of starts to fall off. She she's still kind of there, but it, it'll get worse. I assure you. <laughs> I think Chewie's really strong. She can attack much faster than Aura. That is true. She has like rapid fire, which is different from Aura. Her DPS is way higher. Speed is speed is all that really matters. Uh, arm does more raw damage, but Chewie has way more DPS. And when you're trying to burn down a boss, DPS is all that matters. <laughs> Whoa, that spider. It's an MMO mindset. Sure, that's why I play Monk instead of <laughs> Scholar. Yeah, the Scholar is definitely DPS. Alright, well, I don't see Jibubu out, so I guess he'll... We'll see him when, you know, we actually have stairs to properly see him with. But that is for next time. So, next time, we're going to keep heading into the Sun and Moon Temple. Hopefully, it won't take... Or... Well, I guess hopefully it won't take 10 minutes for us to get in there. <laughs> and also, <laughs> hopefully, they have way more Atla than just two. I mean, you're definitely giving people what they want. People want to see build-ups. <laughs> yeah, now we one-shot everything. <laughs> it's a blast. Anyway, until next time, we'll see you guys later. Later. <laughs>